Hello everyone! Yesterday I made a video on how to make this uh, gorgeous bracelet and I even made um, a matching earrings and a matching uh, ring and today I'm going to show you how to make um, the earrings and I even made um, other colors so I'm going to show you how to make this one and also I will in this video I'm going to uh, show you how to make the earring the, the ring too so uh, let's begin our materials I have two colors of 11 of uh, seed beads and also I have a teardrop and this is 10 millimeter and super dure and also bicon this is three millimeter and I have the earring findings and my beading needle number 11 and um, the thread I'm gonna use is this one so uh, I'll do the earrings first so let's begin my uh, silver uh, 11 o first so uh, I pick up seed bead bicon seed bead super do seed bead bicon seed bead super do seed bead bicon seed bead super do seed bead bicon and seed bead uh, super do so i'm going to pass through all the beads Then exit to a uh, super do. Then I can cut my uh, tail. Coming out from the bottom hole, I'll pass through the top hole. Then I'm going to use my. Uh, I'm going to use my green color of my eleven O. Pick up one, pass through the next, super two, pick up another one, pass to the next, pick up another one, pass to the next super two, and pick up another one, pass to the next. Then pick up three silver eleven O pick up another three pick up 
pick up another tree. Pick up another tree. Sit to the middle. Then I'll pick up five of silver. Then exit to the middle. Then I'll pick up three. Three eleven of silver and then pass through my uh, teardrop. Then pick up another tree. Then skip the tree seed bead and pass through teardrop and the first seed bead and pick up another two then I'll pick up one of my green pass through Then pick up one green. I'm going to just pass through one more time So it's done. So the earring is done. Just 
pretty and I'm going to show you next how to do the ring so at the beginning of the video I already show how to make this so my thread is coming out the middle so I'm going to pick up three and pick up three so I'm making um, a right angle rib so that's my uh, two so pick up another three so this is my third one Then pick up another three. So this is my fourth. So pick up another three. So this is my fifth uh, right angle. So I'm going to continue. Uh, so this is my five. So I, I want to make 17 so um, I'm going to continue making uh, 12 more so I completed my 17 uh, right angle so my thread is coming out so my thread is coming out then I'll pick up one then pass through then pick up another one Then pick up one bead, then pass through. Then pick up one. Then pick up another one. Then pick up one. So I'm going to continue adding one to fill the gap. So I'm going to pass through my beads until pass through and exit this way. So 
So I'm going to start adding one on this side to fill the gap. And I'll continue adding one bead until um, here. This is my uh, my last uh, bead. So I'm going to just uh, make some couple of knots before I cut my thread and the ring is done. So the ring is done and uh, it's cute. So the size of this is, um, I think it's like uh, Eight. you know if you if you want to make it smaller just reduce the number of uh, a right angle weave but this one fits in my uh, and this one I made yesterday I think this is size uh, that this fits in my uh, ring finger and this one I made 15 15 um, right angle and this is size uh, almost 6 so uh, I hope you like it in the matching uh, the matching earrings so pretty Hope you like it. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day. And happy beading.